kimono. There is no charge for the service. It also provides free tea. The Chinese traveler says he's happy to be able to put on a kimono for the first time. The department store aims to increase its sales by 25% this year by offering special services for foreign tourists. However, stores in Hong Kong are having a tough holiday season. Stores targeting shoppers from mainland China were nearly empty today. Hong Kong has a reputation as a shopping paradise where high-quality foreign products are sold at duty-free prices. But the number of Chinese tourists fell 15% in December from a year earlier. The yuan has lost more than 4% of its value against the Hong Kong dollar in the past year. This has made shopping there more expensive. This store owner says the number of shoppers is down 50% and sales have fallen sharply. But the number of Chinese tourists coming to Japan is on the rise. Some businesses have come up with the ideas to attract, have come up with ideas to attract Chinese visitors after the New Year holidays. This company decided to distribute cherry blossom viewing guidebooks to Japanese restaurants in China. The firm hopes the guidebooks will encourage Chinese tourists to visit Japan again during the cherry blossom season in March and April. Guru Nabi's Michihisa Kono says many Chinese are very interested in the Japanese tradition of cherry blossom viewing. He says his firm wants to encourage Chinese to visit Japan repeatedly. But the signs of an economic slowdown in China are increasingly visible.